say they don't go there. Thank you. It's for the Christmas. It's for the Christmas. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, but tell me about this bracelet you have on. This one. I know it signifies royalty. Yes, it does. It's tell a, me about it. What's so, it called? So when you, I, I don't know what it's called. Oh, okay. It's I fine. I don't know. Yes, but when you are made uh, like a chief, uh huh, then you can wear one. So you are a chief. Yes. Okay. What is your title? My title is um, Nana Biafe. Uh huh. Appel the first. Nana Ediafe Appel the, the first. first. Chief yeah. of. Oh yeah, Chief of. Oh yeah. What is it? I was Mori. Mo At Mori. Mori. Yes. Mori where you Mori was Cape Coast. Oh, I see. The central. Region. Oh, I yes. see. Congratulations on so that. So it's like um, it's like. A, the chief of development. Oh, yes. yes. I see. That's nice. <laughs> That's nice. I, I don't tell anyone. Oh, you don't tell anyone about it? Yes. Well, my curious self, I wanted to yes, know. Yes, 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 because yes. I've seen a, a, a few chiefs wear it as well. So yes. that's why I was asking. But how have you been? I'm great. Well, Merry Christmas to you. Same to you. First of all, do you celebrate Christmas? I do. Oh, okay. I thought you don't. I do. I oh, do, you I do. do? Yes, I do. So what's the plan with the family? Um, The family, rather, they don't. Oh, they don't. They don't, but okay. I do. Okay. <laughs> so I, I, um, I'm doing my shows. Uh huh. And then when I'm done, I'll stay home for a few days. I'll go to Kumasi and go and celebrate it with my mom. Yes. Who celebrates Christmas? Exactly. Is it not weird living in a home with your family and they don't celebrate the same festivals and mark the same calendar as you do? Not at all, because you know. My family, my wife, my children, they are complete individuals. Yes. Independent of what I like and what I don't like. Uh -huh. You know, so the beauty of that is that the, the diversity or the unity in that diversity where we all let each other be. Yeah. So you celebrate this one. Go ahead and do it. Uh -huh. You celebrate. Go ahead and do it. So it's not about um, forcing people to like what you like. After all. The fewer, the merrier. Exactly, that's true. <laughs> but, but for the kids, usually yes. the fathers would insist that, okay, so if I belong to a certain religion or if I believe in these things, then I want my kids to toe that line until they are 18 and old enough to decide for themselves. You know what's interesting? Before I married my wife, uh -huh. uh, my wife is a Jehovah's Witness. You yes, know I know so that. So before I married her, we had a conversation about where the children are going to be. Uh huh. And then because I was madly in love, I said, oh, they can be with you. Oh. So now that they are old, uh -huh. I don't want to, I want to be seen as a serious person, you know, so uh -huh. I don't want to go back and negotiate. Exactly. So they are with her. I know. see. When they are old enough, wherever they choose to go, plus celebrating Christmas or not is not consequential. Exactly. You know, so. For you it's not, right? It's not, not at all. It has nothing to do with anything. At all? At all. Is it not about the birth of Christ? Is that not? For, for me, it's more about the life of Christ. Okay. It's not about the death or the birth for me. Okay. It's more about the life. It's more about the forgiveness. It's more about the service. Mm -hmm. It's more about the kindness. Okay. It's more about doing for regular people so mm -hmm. that you have done it for Christ. Yeah. You know, it's yeah. all about enlightenment, about being kind. That's for me. For me, I don't look at the life or the death of Christ. I, the birth or death. I mm -hmm. look at the, the life, life of the Christ. quality of life. Can I be Christ-like? Okay. That is where my focus is. And that's what you're doing now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> doing everything. I mean, you, you're such a lovely person and you Thank encourage you. people so much. Thank you. Sometimes Thank I you. wonder if you have your down moments as well. And if you do, do you have people in the industry who come to your aid? I, I have not had a down moment in a long time. When okay. I was turning 40, uh -huh. I had a down moment. I what was happened? afraid. I was afraid. I'm 40, I'm going to grow. I'm going to lose my audience. My music is not lo no longer going to be cool. Yeah. I'm going to be old. You know, so it depressed me small. Oh. But when I got over that, no, I don't have down. Because, my dear, I have, I have the humility to accept that the only thing I can control is what's happening in my head. Mm -hmm. Everything else around me, I have no control over it. You know, so whatever happens to me, I position my mind to be joyous. Yeah. You know, so... Regardless. Regardless. But so you say you got over that depression. What did you do to get over it? I slept for a year. Mm -hmm. Yes, I kept quiet. I, 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 I found myself. I did some meditation. I learned. I spoke to doctors. I read. I stopped eating meat. Oh. I started drinking more water. I exercised more. Yeah. And then I... Unlearned mm -hmm. some of the things that caused me to have expectations yeah. about things that I didn't have control over, you know. And immediately, I came to understand that I have no control over what's happening. Yeah. Then, my depression went away. Uh, recently, you, <clears throat> you caught fire on Twitter. 
<laughs> <laughs> How many of you are on Twitter? Did you see that whole back and forth about it? I mean, it, it was a tweet. Which one I get? I, I catch I catch so, so, so every week. So this was from, you know, something that Nashako had posted and you responded to it. Yes. And, you know, it was about the motorway, I believe. Yeah, it was about, uh, it was about the fix the country. Fix, yes. Yes, the Julo B house. Exactly. You made yeah. a statement that didn't favor people at all. And I, since I, then, they've been tagging you. But I don't, I don't know why. Wait, I don't, so you don't understand. Know why. I don't know because okay. now came now, now posted some people. Yes, I think uh, Alan, Honorable mm -hmm, Alan, mm -hmm. um, His Excellency John. Yes, and another one. And the vice president. I think the vice president yes. was one of them. Yes. Yes, and uh, who who else? I'm trying to remember. You and carry Okupreku, on. Yes. You know, and ask which one of these is going to save Ghana. Mm -hmm. And I said, Nah, you now nah will save Ghana, beginning with your health. Beginning with your mindset, mm -hmm. with your community, with your family. And then if everybody decides to turn on their lights, including the people that you have mentioned, Ghana will have sparks of light everywhere. Mm -hmm. So people said, I've said that we should fix ourselves. Yeah. You know. Yeah. But I said, we should save ourselves because the corruption that is in Ghana, it's not outside of me. Mm -hmm. It is all of it is inside me. I'm the one looking for uh, boarding for my, my, my nephew. I'm the same guy who is making a quick turn, the police catching me, and I am telling the police, Jekakra Nejame. Yeah. I'm the one who is trying to get ahead of everybody. I am the corruption mm -hmm. that is inside Ghana. And the same way, I am the same person who possess the love that I want to see to bring development. Exactly. So if I turn on the light of that love inside of me, and everyone turns on that light, mm -hmm. you know, so it became like a two-day conversation. And then someone asked, that, what about the motorway? Exactly. You know, yeah. and then I said that, it, for me, I am 47 years old. I would rather work hard to find money to fix my shocks than to trust a politician. Because I know that no one will fix the motorway. Mm -hmm. Because I've been using the motorway since 1996, and it has never been fixed. Been fixed. During Kufour's time, it was dark. Rollins's time, it was dark. Mm -hmm. Atamil's time, it was dark. Everybody's time. So I know that, so I'm not going to, I've already told you, that my state of mind is to stay joyous, no yeah. matter what is house happening yeah. outside of me. So based on that philosophy, and then they said that I had insulted them. Well, well they, they said that they, you know, from what you said, Clearly, we're not holding the leaders accountable. So I remember that every time there was a problem and someone posted maybe the potholes on the motorway, they'll say, well, Chairman Kwame says that you should rather fix your shocks I, but, but than, I, than but I didn't, focus on the politicians who are supposed to do what they I, ought to I do. I didn't say that, but who voted the politicians into power? Mm. You and I. Mm -hmm. We did it. We choose our terrible leaders. We are terrible. So the, the politician is the perfect reflection of the voter. So we should be blamed partly of for course. partly or entirely for you, the state not, not, of the not nation. Not entirely. We okay. need to blame the politician and hold him accountable. Mm -hmm. But we need to first blame ourselves and hold ourselves accountable for our decisions so that we don't make them again. Mm. 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 But it begins with you. Okay. You cannot go outside of yourself and begin to question others and point wag fingers at everyone. Don't forget it that the last three are pointing, are pointing at you. At you yes. So we, we Ghanaians, we must change our mindset. We must fix our relationships with our children mm -hmm. to show them love. We must be honest to our girlfriends. We must, we must work t on time. Mm. If we go to church, we must be Christians. We must show Christ. That we can't go to church on Sunday, pray for forgiveness, and on Monday go and take a bribe and delay someone's procurement document so that... By Friday, that person will bring a cake back. And it, it doesn't make sense. Yeah. So, we, so if, how many politicians do we have in Ghana? A thousand, two thousand? If all the politicians in Ghana become great and the 30 million of us still behave the same we behave, there's no development. Mm. So the light must begin with us. That is the only one you can control. Exactly. But, but when you said that you caused a lot of backlash, did that affect you no, mentally? No, not at all. Emotionally? The same way I disagree with people. Why can't people disagree with me? Okay. People can disagree with me. Okay. And when I disagree with people, like I've, what I'm saying, disagree with a lot of concepts out mm -hmm. there. A lot of people are going to disagree. This is why I, I disagree with people. And the way they deal with their disagreement, 
either through cognitive dissonance, either through insults, either through um, what in logic we call mm -hmm. ad hominem, mm -hmm. name calling. That's the way they want to express themselves. Yeah. I can't control that. You can't. So, so um, there was a tweet that said, this is Kwame. Kwame endorses Fix Yourself. Kwame believes that leaders should not be held accountable because no one is a messiah. And he says, don't be like Kwame. Tweets like this didn't bother you? Not at all. But which part of my tweet said that? Mm -hmm. I didn't say fix yourself. Mm. I said, let us all fix it together. Okay. All of us who, to fix. I didn't say fix yourself. I didn't say let's not hold the, the leaders accountable. I didn't say that. Plus, if you are organizing um, an event, mm -hmm. maybe you are organizing uh, a campaign or a movement, that calls the... The Flagstaff House, Julobi House. Yeah. You didn't come to consult me. Mm. And you want Chinchina, you want me to come and be a part of it. I am not known to be insulting adults. So the Julobi was an insult. For you, that tag was disrespectful. Of course. Okay. So if my father had lived, it would have been the same age as the president. And I can never call my father Julobi. If they called me, if I, I joined that and they called me to court and say, prove that there's a Julobi, where was I going to find proof? Mm. So, what I do is turn on the light of love in me. But they said that the Occupy Jolobi is supposed to speak out about the ills in society and the fact that leadership has failed many young people. And so that is why leadership they has failed me out on the streets. Leadership has failed me. Uh -huh. And I think it has failed a lot of people. See, I am an artist. For pe before people can buy my music or go and watch a show or come to see a theater, that person must eat, pay school fees, mm -hmm. find money for hospital, insurance, pay their workers, pay electricity. So when the economy becomes the way it has become and we, are, we keep borrowing, I am the, the last person to eat. Mm -hmm. So I know how it feels. However, everything can be done. Maturity is how. Okay. I am not interested in joining things that insults others. Okay. Because I am not innocent. So you can express dissent, but do it respectfully. That is, however they want to do it, they should do it, but they shouldn't force me to join it. But have the leaders respected citizens? If you look at the state of the nation, and I'm not just talking about the current government, over the years, would you say that leaders have respected us enough? Well, well, what is, to what, end what, 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 respect? What, what is respect? Mm. What is respect? To behave in a way, a manner that's favorable to others because you want to get something back, because you want a vote, or to be honest, to, to, to deal with people honestly, with integrity. Mm. See, if you put your hands behind your back and you take my time for granted, no matter how demure or how stoic your yeah. meaner is, your demeanor is, you are still not respecting me. Mm. You know, so I don't think that we, as a people in Ghana, we can talk of respect. I don't think we can talk of, because the nation lacks integrity. Yeah. There's no integrity in education. There's no integrity in religion. Mm -hmm. There's no integrity at home. There's no integrity in relationships. There's no integrity in business. Yeah. The nation lacks integrity. The type of solutions that I want for this country it's not just walking on the street. Too. It's for us to go to why we are so vile. And it begins psychologically. Something has happened to the African mind. Mm. Something has happened to it. You need to read King Leopold's letter that he wrote to the missionaries to send to Congo. Mm -hmm. And then you understand that something has happened to us. Yeah. Our education system is based on regurgitation. Mm. It is based on competition. So the one that comes first is applauded and given a gift and a card. The one that comes last is who tethered. Yeah. So when that person grows and ends up in parliament, he will not come last. No, he will do whatever he it must takes. do, cut whatever, to be the one in the Range Rover, to be that one who lives at East Legon. Mm -hmm. So that person has been broken from childhood. That is the problem we must solve. How do we solve it? By coming together again, I'm talking okay. psychologists, mm -hmm. sociologists, anthropologists, philosophers, all, the gists. all of them coming together to redefine what is culture. 
Okay. To redefine what is moral. This are the traditional ideas and nuances versus the use of technology, influx, the media, social media, to redefine what is moral. Mm -hmm. And then through progressive media activation, retell people okay. that this is the new way. This is the new Ghanaian. The billboards that we put in town, we need to use that to, di to discuss thinking. Mm. We, there must be a million billboards across Ghana saying think. Because Ghanaians are not thinking. Of course, not just Ghanaians, Africans. We're not thinking. No, if we think, how come we own only 10% of our gold? How come our gold is called Anglo gold? You see, the highest level of thinking is creativity. Yeah. And so why is it that our gold is called? Because we do not have the creativity to create the machines and the shafts that can go down to fetch the gold. Yeah. So the one doing the thinking owns 90%. And then we own, How, yeah. What is the percentage of that we, owe, we own in our oil? Yeah. Is it also 10%? No, it's, I think it's about five or so. How many Chinese yeah. people are here fixing our roads? You see them. Yeah. It, these are all thinking problems. And that is the problem we must solve. Because once we solve the problem of thinking and creativity, then we are going to own patents. Mm. We are going to invent stuff. Then we are going to export and lower the income export deficit. Mm. That is the only way. But it begins with being honest. We, we have to be honest we with ourselves. We have to be honest with ourselves. Yeah, yeah. I agree, I agree. And I know you've been championing this cultural thing for a while, of course, encouraging Ghanaians especially to embrace our culture. How is that going? It's going great. You know, yeah. last week I got an award. Yes. I got yes, an yes, award yes, from yes. a national award mm -hmm. for my contribution towards Made in Ghana yes. and tourism. It's going great. It's, yeah. going, it's going fine. So, I'm excited for you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now, what? I see that more people are interested in posting a PCA on Instagram than fried rice. Uh, so. Well, <laughs> <laughs> like you said, it's a, it's a gradual thing. It's Psychologically, a, we're it's getting a there, thing. right? Yes. But it's Christmas. I don't want us to. Yes, we've gone there already. You, we've already <laughs> gone there. There was one more I wanted to ask you. Should I ask? Ask me. Ask so you me. tweeted about drinking water in bits. Yes. Because you said too much water leads to dehydration, and that's yes. when you're drinking your water. Drink it in bits and add a bit of salt. Yes. It was fact checked. Yes. And that also, you know, caused some controversy because this was a few days or so after you had tweeted about this whole. Uh, then lately, know, fix, I, I, I get... Fix uh, the country. Yes. Yes. Uh, tell me a bit about that. So there's, there's a doctor uh -huh. who's done a lot of research on dehydration. He's mm -hmm. actually a spine doctor. Mm -hmm. he, his area is spine and the mind. And he says, I think his name is Eric Beck. And he says that the concept of hydration is not just water in your system. Mm -hmm. It is water and some minerals, especially sodium. Okay. So if you drink a lot of water, so my conversation was about, my, I was talking about myself. Yeah. That at my age, work, I work out two hours every day. Mm -hmm. And when you work out, you lose a lot of sodium. You lose a lot of water. Mm -hmm. So every day, I put a, a, a half teaspoon of Celtic salt okay. in my first glass of water after my workout so that I will be hydrated and that, if you drink too much water and you are not running under the sun and you are in an air condition all day and you are drinking too much water, you are rather going to be dehydrated. So it begs the question, what is hydration? Mm -hmm. Is it just water in your system or the right balance of water and sodium in your electrolytes? Yeah. So if hydration is the balance of sodium and water, what type of fat checks are they doing? Who did they ask? Mm. But, but if you read some of them, of course, if you, and of course, if you Google, you'd understand. They exactly. say that drinking too much water does not cause dehydration. The lack thereof is what causes dehydration. Which site is this? I'm reading from people who are fact-checked, by the way. And so this is from Ghana Web, for example, where the media put out a fact-check and said that um, they wanted to clarify these claims. And that's why they're saying but, that. But I quoted the person that I'm quoting. Mm -hmm. And, you know, sometimes when we talk about health, mm -hmm. and um, let, let me quote Hippocrates, okay. who is the father of modern, um, modern medicine. He says that if you are not your, your own doctor, you are a fool. Mm. Because the aim of medicine is to make sure that people don't need medicine. Okay. You know, so it's not about waiting to get sick, 
waiting to have a headache so that someone gives you a paracetamol to numb your pain against mm -hmm. the actual thing which is causing your headache. Yeah. So it's about digging a bit deeper because the system is interested in taking your money. Okay. So if you are interested in staying healthy, you need to you need research to. what is happening and listen to what is happening inside of you. Okay. Well, I, I would also credit webmd.com, cdc.gov, Agawal et al, um, 2008. These are some of the um, literature reviews that led to that conclusion that it was false. But let, let's move on. It's Christmas. I know you have an event coming. Yes, up. yes, yes. So I have, Tell a, us. I have a 25th. Okay. Um, it's called the Hip Life Party. Oh. That is, has been going on for four years. Uh -huh. So this is my fourth year. So every year I bring classic, you know, hip life artists to create, to recreate nostalgia. Yeah. Like it used to happen in the mm -hmm. early 20s mm -hmm. and the mid 90s. You know, so this year at Plus 233, I've lined up amazing artists that um, if you come to Plus 233 from 9 o'clock and 1, we are going to give you back to back to back to back mm -hmm. live music, mm -hmm. hip life party. You, it's, it's going to be a great experience. So who's going to be there apart from so, you? So apart from me, I'm having Rutai. Uh-huh. We have uh, Kwabna Kwabna. Nice. We have a free year. We have um, Crazy Keys and the Soli Bear. They are opening. We have um, Way 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 I. You know, we have Screw Face mm -hmm. and and other surprise artists. Artists. Wow. So, twenty fifth December, plus two three three. Come and let's have fun. You're going to perform. Asama to me, Obi, oh, Kelly, mommy, Achiami. Let's do it together. Definitely. Do you guys remember that rap? Yeah. Mm, are you sure? Where are you born? Okay, so let's do that. Okay. Asema to me, Obi, Kelly, mommy, Achiami, Atome, Mene, Mene, Nyami, Me, I'm Biji to me, yo, Marasheti, Obi, Chuma, Swa, Beni, Chami, Thirty. We can't even say, we won't find that. We see that man had time to die. We might want to see it. We won't be high. Family body chemi, obi di she, mandela midi, we ne midi, adi ami ye ye, mi dream wa mi tia tia, eti mi da mi da, da kanta, a kanta, mi tu mi jina, emra se se mi tu mi kete ka, mi chemi ni, eso mi hu bi a di se wa, se se, o wa dream dream kwa, eso mi tia tia ko fa no biom odo, ma ji wa di, ma ji wa tu ma be fi koto, a fe na me ose, hey, let's see if they can sing too, me ya me ya wun komo de, abra ora ho, me fa me hun te te, da me sra ho, me de yodon tu ma pa, e be fra ho, a hun bra si e pa bua, e be sha, u tun tun se yo, ma ye kado, me se bu ano, ba wa ti en wa ho, she yo ba peni, pa me san se ni. <laughs> oh my god. I'm looking forward to the event tomorrow. Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes, yes. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you.